I'm Jimmy Chang, and we're here to talk about gram to pound conversion. Now, grams are used in the metric system a lot, and pounds is what's typically used in the English system. There is a relationship between the two, though, so let's talk about what they are. Now, the important thing to remember is that one pound is equal to 453.59 grams. So right off the bat, you see that one pound is already a lot of grams. So when it comes to converting grams to pounds, you got to keep that in mind going forward. So let's just say if you have 300 grams and you're converting it to pounds, one thing you want to think about is you have 300 grams, now since pounds is what you want to think about and you're converting from grams, you just got to fill in the numbers where they belong. So one pound, you have the one up here, and 453.59 is where you would put next to grams. Now if you want, so this doesn't feel left out, you can put this over one and the grams will cancel and the pounds will stay put and you'll be left with 300 over 453.59 pounds. Now, obviously this is a number that's going to be less than one, but um, you can use a calculator to find out the exact value of this. But needless to say, one pound is worth an awful lot of grams, so 300 grams would not even be a pound. But once you have that conversion, you'll be good to go for all gram to pound conversions. So I'm Jimmy Chang and that's how you convert grams to pounds.